Oops, wait. The sound. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Read Hidarashi. Um, on a side note, I did a hour long um, recording of Fault yesterday for that read through with the headset microphone, and sadly, the video like overloaded or something. I'm not too sure. I'm not good with technological stuff, but it messed up the audio. So yeah, that was kind of dumb of me to do like use a new microphone and make an hour long video, but oh well. But I before this recording up oh, trains. I did um I did test the microphone and change the settings to make it more so the encoding wouldn't overload, kind of like lower the settings. But um yeah, after listening to the mic without the overload, it's still worse than the webcam mic. So that's kinda of disappointing. But so I guess we're just gonna rock with the webcam mic. I mean eventually maybe I'll be able to uh, switch to a a real microphone, but I think that's pretty decent. This my it's just the background noises are kind of annoying, but yeah. So there's that. I don't know. Maybe I'll make another hour video for fault, <laughs> just as I feel bad. <laughs> At least it wasn't anything like too climactic. It's just an hour long video for the sake of being an hour long. But anyways, we're reading Higurashi, not Fault. Um, maybe I should do an hour long video for this. Oh yeah, this would be the tenth episode, so yeah, let's make this an hour long video for fun. Or is this the ninth? I yeah, uh, I don't remember. Let me chat. Don't worry, it's worth it. It's worth the extra time, because then you get, like, it's like two episodes in one, since all my, um, all my, <laughs> all my videos recently have been only, like, 30 minutes, or 40 minutes. It's just been because I've had a pretty dry throat recently, so, yeah. But, oh yeah, that would be, um... This would be the tenth episode, if I'm not crazy. No, this is the ninth. Oh, yikes. Okay, next episode, we'll do an hour long. But for this one, it'll be probably normal time. Whenever the chapter breaks allow us it. Alright. Oh yeah, you... This scene isn't where we left off, but basically we're at the end of the chapter, and this is just what happened right next. With Mion's thing. Okay, let's jump right into this. Right now. Boom. Oh, did they off screen that? You didn't even get to see it. I was pretty interested in it, too. Ooh, flashback? Okay, at least we got some insight on it. Unlike my house, the Ryudu residence wasn't newly constructed. It had been renovated from a pre-existing building. Well, the house itself was fine. The problem was the yard. There, it was crammed with rows upon rows of oddities. They were all the same as Colonel Randy, stuff you'd see while walking around in town. The Tate Shop's mascot, Lil Licky. The Toad Lamone in front of the pharmacy. She even had the amazing flying elephant from the top of the department store. <laughs> so Rena's just hoarding. Surprised her parents are fine with that. <laughs> uh, cute mailboxes. She must have just thought about it because her face filled with delight. 
出かけだ<笑>でお部屋には小さいものがごっちゃりと陳列してありますの前に拝見したことがあるでございますわでリカちゃんみたいなかわいい子は地下室にしまうのかうんうん何でもしまっちゃうよ<笑>そしてたにてんしゅうれつばっとるなあ、なあ、なあ、なあ、なニューヨークに自由な女神ってあるだろ<笑> Yeah, let's steal this Liberty Tower. あれ ?Or Statue of Liberty. Why did I say Liberty Tower? うん、かいいよ。The US should probably come up with some countermeasures ASAP. If not, the Statue of Liberty really will take a trip to Hinamizawa in the not so distant future. Oh boy. Omatase s h i m a s h t a desu. Ah, Rika. Rika Chen had returned. So, who is in your body? Not there, almost look now, you know. What happened? Naka Yatanoka. Sirena. リカはケイチさんのような不良とは違うでございます。Oh, サラトーズ defending リカ。<笑>違うよ、ケイチくん。リカちゃんはお祭りの実行委員さんなの。フェスティバル、おやだ。フラワーズ called Wata something。Whatever the settling volume's name is, that festival's coming up。祭り学校の文化祭かなんかのケイちゃんケイちゃんこの前言ったじゃん村祭りだよ渡流しのお祭り That, yeah, I remembered sort of I knew it started with a W 渡流し or something like that Oh, come to think of it She did say there'd be a festival at the shrine during the next break その渡流しって何なんだ灯籠流しみたいなもんか最後に沢に流すってとこだけは同じかな傷んで使えなくなったお布団とかとてらとかにね、okay. ご苦労さまって感謝して供養しながら沢に流すお祭りなの OK Sounds nice The people living in Hinamizawa dump their futons and padded clothes in a street It sounds like it'd be a lot of trouble if it backed up the current. Maybe they should just drop some fish in it and have a fish wrangling competition. Skewer them and sprinkle a little salt. Oh man, I can smell it already. <laughs> Did she read our mind? <laughs> Because it's sad to tell me. Best character. And trains. Uh, thank you, train. And good morning to you, too. What sort of face could have expressed what I'd imagined just now? Rena demonstrates for me. I see no argument here. Ma, so n a n o m o s i r m o n o j a n a i k e s a t a n o s i m i n i s t e r i a i s a m i n a d e k o t o i t a m u k a i n i k u a r a n e I don't really feel like going to festivals unless someone asks me to. I wouldn't get bored if these guys were going. Mion's proclamation came as she looked at each member in turn. What was all this about? From the way Mion looked, it was probably. Four demon firefight. More club fun. <laughs> 
sound scary for sure. Of course you would, Rena. I tried to object sharply, but since Rena looked happy about it, I decided it was pointless to fight it. Rita Chan made a small correction in light of my presence. <笑>その通り、日々の厳しい試練を乗り越えた精鋭中の最精鋭たる我々の実力を。でも去年は村長さんに怒られたし、今年は迷惑をかけないようにしないとね。What <笑> Rita Chan really is the only one who explains things so they made sense. I see, so we'll be exhibiting on those busy festival grounds. Reno is right, of course that would be a reason for them here to get angry. Um. So I just got the encoding thing, so I'm just gonna stop the video and check it, and then if it's good, we'll, um, we'll just connect the next recording over. Okay, one second, guys. Alright, we're back. We're back. It didn't do anything, so I don't know what that's about. Whatever. I mean, we're not, we didn't really change the setup, so it should be fine either way. Except for the headset, but I don't see how that would change the encoding, right? Just using the speakers on my headset. Anyways, let's just continue on. No more interruptions. That's annoying. That was the only point I did not doubt. It would be, without question, fun. The day of the festival was drawing near. <laughs> Okay, what's up for today? Our voices rang out in unison. やっぱり人数が多いときはトランプが一番の王道だよね。まさにこれぞ、テーブルゲームのベーシック。また頑張りトランプか? <laughs> oh, well, that was fair. Just to be safe, everyone checked the cards. Yeah, no sneaking stuff, Neon. Uh, I used to play President a lot. Though I'm kind of forgetting the rules, but I know that's a card game I used to play at school lunch. How do you play that again? I forgot. It's been so long since I played that. Another standard card game. First one to get rid of all their cards wins. The basic rules play a better card than the one before. You can play straights and pairs. There are various techniques that improve the game. Like reversals. But it but because it's such a well known game, there are lots of house rules for it as well. The name for example. In my hometown we call it Millionaire. Kind of coming back to me. Ooh. 
While I was confirming the familiar rules, Sagito looked over at me cautiously. I probably should have tried to look like more of an amateur. I was pretty used to this game. It's president, and it's with a new deck. Today, I might be able to win. I had the gist of the rules now, but that wasn't everything, was it? Uh -oh. We never did learn what was written on Kaiji's face, huh? Ooh. Oh, that seemed like it could be interesting. Just don't lose. Easy. <laughs> Mian handed out several slips of paper to everybody. Now then, what would be a good penalty? Worst case scenario, you draw what you wrote. Something too intense would be like digging your own grave. Ooh, yeah, that's cheating. Rita Chan's casual suggestion caused Mion's hand to lurch to a sudden halt. Oh, Mion. I see. Just in case you lost, just grab the note with the folded corner and you'd be safe. Wow, Mion. So sly. That was a good idea. Diabolical as ever, Mion. Rita Chen is quite formidable too, being able to see through that. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Rita Chen's super... She, she knows everything, man. She's super observant. I couldn't underestimate her, even though she doesn't stand out. <laughs> and Rena re writes the meanest one. <laughs> nobody, had, nobody agreed to Rena's proposal. Everybody was ruthless. Yeah, just don't lose. Is that a helicopter? Or a plane? It's not a train, I think. Wow, oh, that's rare. This is usually a train only video series, but getting some variety, some helicopters or airplanes. There you go. <laughs> Rena was quite brutal, even though she usually appeared meek. Better not underestimate her either. <laughs> yeah, for some reason I'm scared of hers the most. I still didn't know what Rita Chan's penalty would be like. <laughs> oh, that's true. Sure, guess this is another uh, intense club activity video. Having confirmed that, Mion dealt out our cards. Finally, the battle begins. Here we go. <laughs> the jams. This is a good battle theme. Oops. Card after card was being was played in the middle. Not needing Mion to tell them. Both Rita Chan and Satchito played their cards without hesitation. Rena and I were the only one who paused to think. It seemed that Rena generally couldn't make up her mind. Jesus Christ, so many interruptions. Dude, this video sucks. <laughs> I had to stop in the middle and uh, whatever. <laughs> I'm sorry, don't worry, next video. Next video is the, the sick one hour special.
So it might just be an Aralon video with nothing happening. Uh, we'll see. It might be fun to do an Aralon video for the festival. That might be a better idea. But I was different! Let's go! I was like a shark stalking its prey, just waiting for the right time to strike. Oh shit. <sighs> good job, Sachiko. You did good. Well, Neon vs. Rena. Oh, wow, Neon lost for like the first time ever, I think. The loser of the first round was of all people, Neon. And now I was certain. Today, I could win. Okay, it's multiple rounds. Made sense, obviously. Okay, that then told you there, but I don't care. I think that's fine. Mion accepted her defeat, scrounged around inside the bed, and pulled out one piece of paper. <laughs> Look at that face. We've never seen that kind of face on Mion. It's like sort of blushing, but it's really shot from her eyes. Jesus. <laughs> <sighs> what happened? Mion quivered and shrieked. Say it. Oh. Rena was also surprised when she peeped at it. What kind of terrible thing was written on it? Oh god. Pet the principal on the head. Oh no. That's actually really scary. I like, tried my best not to interact with my high school principal. I don't know if she was scary or not, but just the fact that their principal is pretty scary. <laughs> Imagine petting them on the head. You can probably get like detention from that, huh? <laughs> well, that makes it worse. Satoko yelled with a serious look on her face. Of course, it was Satoko who did it. Look at that smart smile. But she wasn't as loud as Mion Street. What could it be? A martial arts master? Uh, rest in peace, Mion. It's over. <laughs> He was inhuman. Had that guy's head? I believe in you, Mia. You're tough. You can survive this. She bellowed out a yell as she dashed off down the hallway. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, you'd still feel it, and it'll still be awkward. <laughs> oh yeah, he has super sensory abilities as a martial arts master. What the heck? I could do nothing but wait with bated breath. Hunting sea sludge. Yep, that's... it's over. A rumble shook the classroom. Oh my god. Such perfect flow in a combo. He's even using followers on the tailed opponent. <laughs> Nothing I could do now except stay calm. I understand now why there were no delinquents at the stool. Guess so, huh? After a few moments of silence, Mion slumped back to us. 
これでいい Nice determination, Mion. Mion said before collapsing. Oh my god. I was amazed the person who made the club activities like these could say that. We don't know about that. I think that was Satoko's or Rika's. Rona tried to lighten the mood and was only met with Mion's malicious grin. She was serious now. The pace of the game became bizarrely quick. I could tell the game had gotten more intense. Mion's on fire right now. Uh -oh. Of course. <laughs> Whoa, Sadako vs. Rena. No, my two favorite characters. Uh, who? Okay, it's Rena's turn. It's okay, Rena's also a super human. Maybe she can live. <laughs> and the heavens chose to vanquish Rena. It wasn't exactly hard for her to be worried. Just thinking of the level of difficulty, difficulty of Mion's first penalty still made me quiver. And so, the penalty she drew with trembling fingers was... The heck was this? Speak like a maid. <laughs> Who did that? I mean, it obviously wasn't us. Maybe it was Rita? Or Mion? I mean, Mion would do something worse, right? Honestly, Satoko's like weird trying to be super like. Like the way she speaks, like using big words that doesn't really fit her. Actually, no, that wouldn't be a maid. <laughs> what am I talking about? How would a maid speak? I don't know. And that's like, what about the, um, oh yeah, the servant to Mimineto. Like just, oh, uh, using lots of weird formalities and stuff, and bowing. <laughs> How? Oh, that's weird. <laughs> it hit me like a ton of Brits. I, I had no idea who wrote that penalty, but she was awesome. Yeah, that's awkward. Uh, uh, I had to just die right now. <laughs> he just wants to hear a master. <laughs> the eagerness to which I was goading Rena into addressing me as master was downright impressive. If I do say so myself. Beyond's Beyond ascended, she won't lose anymore. <laughs> I guess everyone's probably just trying to get lose once and take a penalty. So is it our turn? Oh, Rena again? Oh no, but there goes my idea. Rena again? What kind of penalty would it be this time? I was delighted by the mysterious sense of anticipation. Anticipation? No, this was conviction. Remove one item of clothing from the top and bottom half of your body. This sounds like a Mion thing, I think. 
so, 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 my face reddened in anger. If I didn't yell something out, I wouldn't be able to hide my shaking. Ah, uh, who did write that? God, please give that man a Nobel Prize. Nobel Prize. How do you read our minds, Satoko? Not good, not good. What I was thinking was written on my face. Yeah, I think it was Mion. Ran up bad Mion with teary eyes, but everyone knew Mion's answer already. Gotta do it. <laughs> Don't say it like that. Oh, this is so weird. Okay, maybe she didn't take off her tie. Her tie and socks. If you want to cheese it. What? I looked around thinking someone else would probably stop her. Of course I wasn't exactly trying to stop her either. Then I heard the rustling of clothes, the sound of her skirt hitting the ground and sent my heart racing. I looked away like a gentleman. But, but these club activities, you needed to be ruthless after all. Oh. <laughs> she was wearing her gym uniform underneath. That's efficient. I guess especially with those, like, the, I don't know what these are called, the lower clothing. I guess it kind of looks like underwear, so it's probably fine to wear underneath, right? Oops. <laughs> Satoko pulled fun at me, but right now I can't hear it. <laughs> Not bad. I really think that was me on. <laughs> Her, her squirming around in her pee clothes made it impossible for me not to feel anything. C calm down, Kaichi Maibara. Mion probably wrote that one and planned to go after me as I panicked. You can't fall for a trap after knowing it's a trap. Clear your head. Calm down and assess the situation. I was determined to think of my way out of this. And the answer is quite simple. I then became a god. <laughs> I, who had already entered the domain of godhood, what would dare stand in my way? It was like they were pulled to me magnetically. I was picking up aces and twos like nobody's business. <laughs> We've ascended into godhood. Oh, no, Satoko! What's her punishment? What? Speak like a little sister. So wait, are they writing new punishments every game or are they just out of a pool? Because this would be the fourth one, right? That's not a bad penalty, what? Let's, let's hear it, Satoko. <laughs> it's cute. Yes! The pleasure of making this brat disgrace herself. Oh god. Me on last. I don't think Rika's trying to lose though. She's too, she's too smart. I'll draw it out. Wear a girl's school swimsuit. What? No. Oh, that was Mion? 
So this was 05 if it was. Oh, that would be hilarious. Yes! Meon's despair was like sweet honey. Okay, let's see it. Okay, so it's obviously not... I thought it was the five pool, but it looks like they're putting new ones in every time. Uh, <laughs> really? Oh my god. In that outfit. Uh, yeah. She's not wearing a skirt, so it's her bare legs. Teachers ascended, man. Nothing can stop him. This is too much, Ren. <laughs> Obey. <laughs> this is... Yeah, this is too much, man. Rita's not done at least there. I transformed into an evil dictator and couldn't be doing any better. Where's Mion in a swimsuit, though? Haven't seen that yet. It felt like I could control how the cards played out with my mind and even decide what suits would appear just by willing it. By the time I realized it, I already assembled a harem. I was laughing haughtily as I rested my head on Rena, who is now a boomer clad maid. A, b a what? <laughs> Did I read a, a bloomer clad maid? Oh yeah, that's what those things are called, right? Or the whole uniform? I don't know. I do remember that word. I was like, boomer clad maid, what's that? Satoko was wearing a collar. Really? And had taken out, taken on little sister properties. Mion was fanning me while wearing a school swimsuit. This one, I'm not gonna see that. Unlucky. Well, it is about time Kaichi wins at something in the club. <laughs> I began to think, why does man have no end to his desires? How could I wish for more than this palace of dreams? <laughs> Why is he getting so deep? Oh my god, that was it. Rita Chen hadn't been in first, but she continued to escape being last. <laughs><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Oh my god, what is this? Rita Chen said in her usual calm manner with the cheery tone. And now Rita's gonna beat us because she's amazing. This was undoubtedly a declaration of war. Oh, we got it. The thing led me on. It's kind of like... It's, it's kind of it's weird, honestly. I don't know why. This part looks odd for me. Defeat this arch default of prison perversion. Oh my god, look at the taller. Now that's cute. Senator's cute. Aww. That's a thumbnail right there. Unless we get a CG. <laughs> Such stoism from this little girl who has always hidden away in Satoko's shadow. It would probably be rude not to meet her head on. I shall face you myself, little one. I saw Mian swap a few cards with Rita Chen in the middle of the game, but I pretended I didn't see it. Do you believe you can defeat Teichi Sama with just that? Me, ace, 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 
Everyone looked over at me. I was still brimming with confidence. Mohahaha. The four of them have aligned against me. That's it. You're making me laugh. <laughs> Sajiko let out a shriek. Mwahaha, <laughs> you simpletons. Using up all her cards before calling the reversal left each Chen with no good cards. She was defeated soon after. Oh wow. She actually lost. Wow. Oh, look at her. It's the first time you get blushing Rika. <laughs> no rip. Oh, what is it? Rare cat ears, a bell collar, and a tail. <laughs> oh my god. Mwahahaha. <laughs> Even the penalties were as I wished. Rita's a cat, huh? Hmm. Donk? Let's see it. Show it. Come on. Rita Chen Hunter had and equipped the three holy artifacts. It was question questionable as to why such things were in Mion's locker, but since I had no objections, I didn't ask. Oh, it's cute too. She's adorable. This was so. Aww. <laughs> I felt like I had become Rena. This was definitely cute. It is really adorable. <laughs> Tell me that like a shot with all four of them. That'd be a good thumbnail. That wasn't me talking, that was the actual the actual Rena. Me. Oh god. As Rita Chen mimicked the cat, teary eyed, rinse of smoke escaped from Rena's ears with an audible poof. Mian gasped and dropped her fist into an open palm. No, this is a thumbnail. This, that's so cute. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this episode? <laughs> they thought that Rena in cute mode would be able to defeat me. Ooh, no, this is a challenge. Cute mode Rena versus God mode Keiichi in President. Would it be that easy? Opposing me was the same as opposing God. I teach them their place. <laughs> For a moment, I didn't know what was going on. The 52 cards dance and flow freely between Rena's hand like the mid machinations of a master magician. Oh god. In the middle of those flowing cards was Rena's ecstatic expression, her head bobbing around. My whole body knew it already. I was going to lose. Nothing can be cute mode, I guess. Not even a god. Denai? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone cheered. I was spent. <laughs> you did good, KG. That was a that was a good run. I appreciate you for what you've done for us. <laughs> uh oh. What's it gonna be? Everyone peeked at it in unison. Jesus flicking between the tats on my face. Uh -oh. Every penalty up until. Oh, that's my dodge. 
Jesus Christ. Um, one sec. Shit. I should pop. I should mute it. What am I doing? Sorry about that. That's hopefully that wasn't happening too long. These new headphones really do cancel cancel outside sound, so maybe that was happening for longer than I thought. Anyways, looks like Taichu is getting his own karmaic retributions right now. So it's made strip swimsuit. Cat ears, fan, little sister, collar. That's it, right? Oh, yeah, and uh, laid, laid, what? I don't know, resting on the person that's to rest on his legs. <laughs> I think that's all of them, right? Little brother. <laughs> but you have the tolerance. <laughs> you are JJG. <laughs> oh, yeah, the shoulder rub. I don't need the lap pillow. <laughs> what, the stripping one? Oh no, the maid. <laughs> you. <laughs> Rena passed out with a squeal, blood spewing from her nose like a fountain. My dignity was being trampled more than a communal doormat. What's up, you know? Okay, at least no swimsuit. Foosh, foosh. Oh my god, she did it. Uh, I thought we were saved. <laughs> Oh my god. Sachiko was like a lone shark. 
Actually, me trying to escape reality as fast as humanly possible was pretty adorable, if I did say so myself. <laughs> the executioners surrounded me, waiting their fingers. Uh-uh. This is why you let Teichi. <laughs> You know, what comes around goes around. My first thought, it was tight around the waist. Second thought, the chest area was pretty loose. Okay. Third thought, the crotch area was... Huh. ケイチクかいかい。あとこれに猫耳と首輪と尻尾をつけて完成しますです。the stern scientific calculating nature mixed with her fascination made me on very scary <laughs> While I was saying that, Mion placed her hands on my shoulders, and Rika Chen slipped up behind me without a sound. Wasn't that the. Oh no, the principal! Oh no, and he has to be dressed like that while petting the principal's head? Ah, oh, here. It's over, Teiji. It was a good run. <laughs> Rita Chan patted my head without saying a word. Oh my god. I stepped forward into the principal's office. My bell collar jingled adorably. The principal froze solid with a smile on his face as he saw me. I couldn't blame him. In this sacred place of study, specifically in his office. Though I said it excuse me as I entered, the sight of a person entering with a stool swimsuit, cat ears, a collar, and a tail. And for it to be a young male student, without a doubt, any normal person's psyche would have stopped cold. But this could be explained. We'll call it uncal uncanny valley camouflage, if you will. When humans see others, they can only be there to act after confirming this is human. Meaning that if he could not comprehend what was in front of him, then in those moments before he could begin to fully process the situation, his mind was completely blank. Ooh, taking advantage of the situation. That was my one and only chance for victory. My penalty. Rubbing the principal's head. <laughs> <laughs> As Zezin sound echoed loudly, he went straight for the special move. The principal said one thing to me. <laughs> and in a heartbeat. Oh my god. The master. Boof. The tremor resounded throughout the Hinamizawa twilight. Wow. Wow, that ended up to be in like an hour long video anyways. Even though we said we weren't going to be it. Honestly, I was just following the chapter bait. So I guess that's good. I guess this is our hour long episode instead of... Nets one, Mondays. That's good. Anyways, thank you for watching. Sorry there's so much interruptions. You know, with the beginning and then me ending the video to those scared of encoding, but I'm pretty sure that doesn't actually do anything because, again, this is basically the same setup, except I'm using a, a different... 
headset, but it's not even for the mic, right? And sorry about the dodge. Hopefully it wasn't going too long, because then I can't hear anything on the outside. So it must have been pretty loud. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's kind of trainer. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed. That was a very, very fun episode. And now the, all the club activity episodes are pretty fun. That was a little over the top. But yeah, and then... Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, and I'll see you next time, hopefully, <laughs> and I hope you have a great day. Bye.